New Zealand has the highest rate of reported violence towards women in the developed world. In 2016, the New Zealand Police investigated over 118,000. Over 118,000. Over 118,000. Family violence incidents in 2016. That's 41%. That's 41%. 41% of a frontline officer's time. Those are some very sobering statistics right there. And this month, White Ribbon is asking men to stand up by taking an online pledge and committing to play a role in violence prevention. We're joined now by Ambassador Richie Hardcore ahead of White Ribbon Day this Sunday. Thanks so much for joining us, Richie. Thanks for having us to talk about a serious topic. I appreciate it. Yeah, no, I, I'm, I'm, you know, you're a multiple champion in Muay Thai boxing, which is quite incredible. Well done on that. You're a personal trainer. You actually um, educate people in family violence don't you as well so why white ribbon for you yeah and f yeah uh, yeah so I work as an educator around family violence prevention and I guess what we call um, reframing masculinity um, why white ribbon uh, I grew up with family violence um, and but I've seen you know my, my father change and become a, a good man and I think all men uh, are capable of doing that and we have to acknowledge that most men are good men. Yeah. You know, like not, uh, uh, however, we live in a broader culture which sort of fosters violence and negative attitudes towards women and indeed masculinity. Mm -hmm. So when I was uh, invited to be, or well, nominated to be a White Ribbon ambassador, I really sort of jumped at the chance yeah. and, and, and have gone on to work for White Ribbon, you know, a number of different organisations around violence prevention. And the thing that strikes me most about what you just said then is that you actually um, are saying that there's hope, that people can change, men can change, situations can change. So those statistics don't have to stay that way. Yeah. It's, look, I'm gonna, I'm, I'll be lying if I said it's going to be like a fast turnaround. No. We're trying to change like embedded conceptions of what it means to be a man and how we assert our masculinity and, 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 and you know. But, um, you know, we have to be doing the work, you know, it's like any sort of cultural change, it's ongoing and it's progressive and we're always learning and um, we're all on our own journeys within that as well, you know. And, you know, with the white ribbon appeal, it's not only about, you know, I guess recognising that this happens and those stats are terrible, but part of it this year is to make good men stand up and talk, because we don't do that enough, do we? Yeah, exactly. I think. I think we should all be aware as a country by now that we have a problem. You know, one in three women are a victim of family violence in their lifetime. You know, you saw the statistics in the video. But how do we give men tangible actions that they can do? So White Ribbon came up with a toolbox. We created eight different little videos that people can go check out at our website, whiteribbon.org.nz, about really simple things that all people are capable of doing. Talking to young men about, hey, you don't have to be tough all the time. It's important to talk about your feelings. Um, you know, we continue to gender emotions. You know, girls cry and soft, right. boys are aggressive and active. Well, that's untrue. Those are taught, learnt behaviours. Oh, boys being boys. Yeah, you know? boys will be boys, um, suck it up, harden up, all those sorts of things lock men in a, a role of behaviour. Yeah. But when you're locked in a role of unnatural behaviour, you're going to explode sometime. So that's evidenced in our family violence statistics, our suicide statistics, our substance abuse rates. Why you know, are they so high, though, Richie? Why are they so high? I think. New Zealand has the highest rates of reported family violence. Not specifically, it's not sp specific to New Zealand. I think that the, the concepts of masculinity are the same anywhere in the Western world. Yeah. Uh, you know, men are con meant to be physically tough, we're meant to not back down from violence, we're meant to use violence, we're meant to have a disdain for homosexuals and be homophobic, we're meant to um, be assertive and active and chase you know money and pursue and have a primacy of work but those are socially imposed ideas yeah there's nothing inherent about those they're not natural but it's what our culture teaches us all the time through our music videos through the jokes our friends make through the memes you see on facebook through movies and the more men are forced into this box of behavior whether it's by teasing or the banter that you hear in the workplace actually the more psychological distress that they have and that's well evident there's a yeah. bunch of very brainy people who've done research around that and so when people are forced into unnatural boxes of behavior and can't be themselves well violence is one of those uh, expressions unfortunately that's why that toolbox is fantastic white ribbon day is fantastic as well so you basically want men to go to that website start up and take that pledge yeah we want men to go check out the website take a pledge and commit to taking those actions whether it's talking to young men in your life whether it's um, acknowledging how you might have been in the past yeah you know and uh, we're not always aware of that our even our communications bad you know how do we foster healthy relationships yeah. without yelling 
you know, like violence isn't just physical, mm. it's emotional yeah. and mental too. How do we encourage uh, men to talk to their sons about healthy sexual relationships when I'm really sorry, Richie. We're, uh, oh, we're going to have to. Gonna we're going to stop It's you. a big topic. It's a yeah, massive yeah, yeah, topic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need so much more yeah. time. Thank you so much, Richie. Yeah. White Ribbon Day is this Sunday, and make sure you check out the White Ribbon website for further <laughs> details, as well as their online tool toolbox. You're doing an amazing job. Thank, Thank you. you, Richie. Oh, no, we might have to get them back on again. Yeah. More about this, I think. <laughs>